Okay, we're going to practice comparing clocks. Okay, so the clocks show three things Mia did Thursday evening. Which did Mia do last? Okay, now please know that the items listed are not necessarily listed in the order that she did them. So do not automatically assume that because eating was listed last at 535 that that is the last thing she did okay so these are all thursday evening so if it's in the evening is that a.m or p.m that's p.m so these are all p.m okay so she had soccer at 9 45 homework at 6 55 and she ate at 5.35. Now, to figure out what she did last, we want the highest time, so the greatest hour. So looking at our hours, we have nine, six, and five. Which one of those is the highest? Nine is, so that means she did soccer last. Okay, next one. The clock show three things Haley did Tuesday evening. Which did she do last? So again, we're doing evening. So that means p.m. Okay, and we want to know what she did last. We have 5.45 for math, 8 o'clock for science, and 8.30 for history. Okay, again, let's look at our hours. We have 5, 8, and 8. Well, I can tell you this much, math is out because math was at 5.45 p.m. And that comes before 8 and 8.30. We want to know what she did last. So now I look at my minutes. I have o'clock and 30, which is later, 8 o'clock or 8.30? 8.30 is. So that means the last thing she did was history. Okay. Let's look at these clocks. Alyssa shows three things she did Thursday evening. What did she do last? Okay, now, again, we're doing evenings. So that's p.m. And we wanna know what she did last. So what time was soccer? Soccer was 9.50, okay? How about homework? See, my hour is 5.20, and my time for eating is 8.25, okay, and they're all p.m., so which one of those did she do last? Which one of those is the latest? Looking at my hour, that would give me the answer. 9.50 is the latest, so that means soccer was last. Okay, these three clocks show what Diana did Tuesday evening. What did she do last? Okay, again, we're evening, so we're p.m., and we want to know what she did last. Okay, so we have 8.50 for math, 8.35 for science, and 5 o'clock for history. Okay, so first we look at our hours because they're all p.m. Which one can I eliminate? Which one can I get rid of? I can get rid of five o'clock with history because that comes before the eight o'clock hour. So that means it's between 8.50 and 8.35 to figure out what she did last. So I look at my minutes, okay? Which is later, 8.50 or 8.35? 8.50 is later. So that means she did math last. Okay, this time the clock show three things Jaden did Thursday evening. Which did he do last? So we're doing evening again, p.m. We want to know what he did last. Okay, so his soccer time was 9.55. His homework was 7.30, and I like to write 
the clocks digitally, if you will, like with the numbers, because it's easier for me to compare that way. And he ate at 910. So which one did he do last? Well, I know it's not homework because that was at the seven hour. Okay. And soccer and eating were at after nine o'clock. So which is later? 9.55 or 9.10? 9.55 is. So soccer was last. Next one. The clock show three things Kaylee did Tuesday evening. Which did she do first? Okay. So we're still p.m. But we want to know what she did first. So we want the earliest time. So she had 8 o'clock math. 810 science and 515 history. So which hour is the lowest hour? 515 is 8 and 810 come after 515. So she did history first. Okay, the clock show three things Angela did Monday evening. Which did Angela do first? Okay, so she had a phone call at 9.20, she had fed her fish at 6.45, and she played at 5.30. Now remember, it's evening, so p.m. for all the times, but we want to know what she did first. So, which hour? Nine, six, or five is the lowest. Five. So that means 5.30, playing, is the first thing she did. Next one. Ashley had three things she did Monday evening. Which did she do first? Okay, we're still p.m. for all the times. We want to know what she did first. Her phone call was at six. 25. Her feeding the fish is at 7.55. And her playing was at 5.45. Okay, so we want to know which was first. So look at our hours. We have 6, 7, 5. Which one of those would come first? Playing would. Good job. Okay, next one. Isabella did these three things Tuesday evening. We want to know what she did first. Remember, evening, p.m. for all. We want first. So math was at 9.30. Science was 5.00. 40, and history was at 9.45. Remember, we want to know what she did first. So we want the lowest hour. We have 9, 5, and 9. Which of those is the lowest? 5 is. So that means science was the thing she did first. Let's do one more. Okay. These are the three things Gavin did Wednesday evening. We want to know what he did first. Evening is p.m. Okay. So he played games at 5.30. He did the violin at 6.20. And then he did walking the dog at 8.20. And I want to know, what did he do first? So I look at my hours, five, six, eight. Which one of those is the lowest hour? Which one of those would come first? 5.30 would be. So the first thing he did was play games. Great job with these clocks.